guys, welcome to the Corvette TR and Happy New Year! It's New Year's Eve in Philippines tonight, 7:30. Okay, so what I have here is Sinan Justine narrative version, uh, Neo Zeon Psycho Frame prototype mobile suit. This is the figure that I got for Christmas, which I don't know if you guys watch my latest video, the the our our Christmas celebration, Christmas Eve celebration. At the end of that video, I showed you the the gifts from Santa and Santa. If you can. If you can watch this, you, you really, this is really hard, you've made me suffer. But it is pretty good, the outcome of my hard work, which really took 6 hours to build this thing, you know, because this is a model kit. And I put my whole time for this thing. So guys, let's get into the details of the box first. The front we got the really badass, badass picture of Sinan Justine. The gun. Really cool pose. At the side, we have the HG Universal Sentry, which, which means high grade Gundam, and this Gundam comes from the Universal Sentry timeline. And another picture at the back, it's black. And at the other side, we have another cool pose and some jar Japanese. But if you want to read this thing, which I already re read, uh, this is the story about Sinanja style. So if you want to read it, pause the video right now and watch it uh, and read it. At the other side, it's the same and nothing more. Oh, I forgot this. This brings the, this shows the cool, the cool accessories. We, we have a bazooka, grenade launcher, um, high beam rifle, beam sabers, and a shield. Cool poses. Okay, now, let me show you this figure <sighs> okay this guy puts a lot of detail uh, pretty much stickers for details but other mechanisms and stuff okay let's do the head wait wait wait, wait. Uh, I can focus the head had have also a sticker on the eyes. Really cool mask. Side of the head. Other details, details. And also I like the the mold of the head because at the back it has a extension thing. This really puts really beauty of the detail okay at the at the body we have the we have a symbol uh, night symbol I think uh, and the, here we have some panels and color blue blue blah 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 
Okay. At the skirt. Yes, he had. He have a skirt. Um, the skirt. The skirts are move, movable. Here, side, the back. Now let's get into the legs. The legs are pretty good looking. As a smooth texture in it. And other mechanical details. Here we, this is a movable movable rocket thingy to fly. Oh speaking of fly at the back there's a rocket boost oh no yeah all of all of the some of the parts are falling off maybe just because of how i build it now let's get into the foot here at, at the Mm, below we have some mechanical details also uh, really really good looking mm, foot that's it that's pretty much it they're the same as the other leg yeah okay now let's get into the back okay let's start this at the back, we have his rocket pack, backpack. There are some rocket, rocket boosts and this capsule thingy, which I really like because it puts very, very cool details to it. Makes you think it's another rocket. And here we have a bag that goes into the hole of the back. At the actual back, we re we have the hole and uh, other mechanical details and no more. That's all it. I forgot something. Posability. Okay, at the head, full 360 and some chicken action he can look that wait that up that down not pretty low and he has a swivel now next the arm so at the arm we have Swivel in the arm, el elbow joint. The hand can swivel too, full 360. And the shoulder pads, the shoulder pads can move up and down. <coughs> and some butterfly movement. At the legs again he has a double knee joint which you can see this is the first and this is the second see the feet has pivot okay at the leg at the foot we have pivot which can make some really cool action poses and it can rotate 360 swivel and that far back that far up and also these rocket things also move okay next the body okay we, it 
have a swivel can rotate that and he can crunch down that far down that far oops I broke it okay 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 note this some of the parts may fall off because it may be not that tight or it is not engineered that well okay and also at the back rocket it could also move up and down only can extend like that yep and now for the accessory this these are the accessories let's first start with the gun um, this is the beam beam rifle and the hand is already attached to it I already attached and I'm scared to take out the hand because I might break it and also a cool feature first later that we have the bazooka and let me put this thing okay let me okay see you in in this is the bazooka which uh which is pretty much detailed and and you can put this thing up in here and also we you could take this off and reattach this long thing Combine it with this, the with the beam rifle. You just got to put this down. Oh god! Oh yeah. There you go. You have your ultimate shot. And at the other, the laser beam. laser beam it has a green color uh, it has a green trans transparent color to it and to find the the holder this is a pretty cool feature just put this thing out you have the handle uh, uh. And now you have the handle and caution you have to be careful with this because this the peg right there which is pretty small and unstable might break or snap okay three two one this is magic now I I have the beam saber. Beam laser or beam saber? I'm really confused. The the figure comes with two beam sabers. This one which I almost snapped is at a bad condition. Which that is why I always use that is why I use this for post now let's pose this thing guys and also we have a this thing 
which does is not mentioned in the in the building in the instructions book so I just made it and I also have this thing it has the parts so I just attach it to one another and boom now you have an amazing staff Woo. So guys, hope you like my review. So leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and have a uh, and re a happy new year and goodbye. <gasps>